Kamuake! I'm going to commit murder as soon as I step my feet into my compound. Uh, wait, wait. Uh, uh, in law, in law, in law. Uh, please, please. What exactly has she done this time around? Talk to me. As I'm talking with you now, that useless boy is with your daughter on our, even my own, my own matrimonial bed. Hey! hey. She not get Hey. 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 Mm -hmm. You mean to say Obi Ajulo brought Ikeme Funa into your house? Hey. Hey. My caseman Ogene called me a moment ago to inform me that that boy just sneaked in with her. <laughs> I am going to catch her. Just walking home, hurrying home to catch her. Red handed in the very act. Of course, she's not expecting me to be back early. Uh, uh, Ilo, wait, wait, wait. Ilo! Yes. Oh God! Uh, uh, please. Come and collect the cups of your infidel daughter that you gave me. Hey. Why? Uh, 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 go, go. Follow him. Papa, if I get there, I'll make sure I break Obi Achulu's neck with my bare hands. Go and serve the situation. Ilo. Go and serve the situation. Ilo, please. Please now, Ilo. Ilo, please calm down. We will settle this. Ilo, why did you say that? I don't care. I have not invested. Ilo, you can. You cannot kill me, Obiadu. Reason 
Why I should not parade her naked in the village? Oh, oh, Just oh, one, oh, one oh, only. Oh, what is the point? My love, I know she has done it, but please, just give me the chance to do it my own way. In fact, in fact, you people should just return the bright price I paid to your family. I cannot continue. Don't live with a harlot in the name of a marriage. Married! Calm down. Calm down. I know, I, I know your heart. Yeah? Have you seen what you've got? Have you seen what you've got? Oh I swear. Hey, I swear. Papa, you won't get that. I'm going to get it. 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 Why? Why? Who has bewitched you? No, tell me. Who has bewitched you, Obi Ajuno? Your mother was a very decent woman throughout her lifetime. In fact, I married her as a virgin. And no man ever saw her nakedness till her death. Just six months. Just six months, Obi Ajuno. You are brought back. Your husband has been frequenting this house every now and then, every other day, with complaints about you. Finally, look at where it has led you to. Look at where it has led you to, Toby Ajunu! Hey! Papa, this same girl has been a problem to this family. Huh? Now tell me why Obi Ajunu looking, looking this beautiful, young and vibrant. We want to get married to a man that is old as her own father. <laughs> if not for her useless way of life that has made her unmarried today. <laughs> eh? Papa, you and I know that no man will want to get married to a girl that has given birth in her father's house. <laughs> eh? Yet she has the guts to bring in that bastard into her husband's house. Now that, now that the, the, the old man who has decided to take her out of shame in her father's house has brought her back home now. Who will marry you? No, Ebuka, leave her. Ah, I will marry her. She will now become my new wife. She will take over her late mother's position. Will you take all these beauty things away from my sight? That's what Papa said you should take these things inside. We make a real call. One at all. Even I go to Rome with you. Unyala. Only two way no more. Only two way no more. Nobody's there. Papa, if not, I was there. That man was ready to strip her naked. You were so lucky that I was there with you. What crime have I committed? What evil have I done to deserve such humiliation and so treatment from my family? You mustn't continue like this. Listen, I have plans. I have good news for us. We, let's go inside. Inside? Yes. No, let's go inside. No one has to hear what I want to tell you now. Please, it's important. Let's go inside. of marriage. If I continue like this, I will die of heartbreak. That is why I'm here. You can't continue to live the rest of your life like this. You can't be trapped in this this kind of marriage. This is this is insane. I have plans, okay?
What plans? Since the man who gave birth to me has rejected me, and my mother's people also, and since your father and his kinsmen have refused to give out your hand in marriage to a bastard like me, like I said, and since this our love can never die, why don't we just take our destiny in our own hands? How? How do you mean? I'm just coming back from Otubo. Okay? There's a farm settlement there. There are lots of people from across the nation living there with their families. All you need to do is pay a paltry sum, build your own hut, and live happily. We can elope to that place and live our lives and get married and raise a family. Otubo? Yes. We can have children there, take care of them, live our lives just like every other person. They are all there settled and they are forgotten about their families. And, and you want me to forget my family just like that? What choice do we have? Your happiness is paramount at this point. Our happiness should what? Our happiness should be uppermost in our minds at this time. We need to be happy. We need to do what makes us happy. Since they have refused to, 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 to hear from us or listen or bear with whatever we are saying, we can't keep going through this humiliation, okay? Please. this. I can't. You have to leave now. You know I'm married. It's you. I know. But you have to go. Okay, but but you, you'll keep what I've just told you you thought, right? Okay. Okay, I'll think about it. But you have to go. Just hold on. I decided to follow the man I love. Don't, don't I have the right to love a man of my choice? What are you doing? Help me carry my bundle of firewood, so I'm divided into pieces. You don't have to. Do you want to come to this forest more than once so you could take all this firewood back to the house? That's some work, you know. Okay, I'll help you carry it. No, it's okay, I'll carry it myself. I'll help you carry it. I volunteer to do that. I said thank you, I will carry it myself. This. You're going to hurt yourself. Let me help you carry this. You don't have to come here more than once. That's the point. It's okay. It's fine. I'll just divide it into pieces. Can you just stop being obstinate and let me help you? Well, if you don't want me to help, I'll go. I, I was just trying to be of help. Let me help you.
Let's help me with the gun. All right, you can get my trap and the bag and the machine. All right, which way? All right, let's go. Let me help you. Let me Don't worry, I will. Thank you very much. Thank you. I mean, you've saved me a lot of stress today. It's my pleasure to have helped. Thank I should you. be rushing back to the bush now. Oh, okay. All right. Um, can I have those? Oh, that's true. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you have a great catch today. Oh. Thank you. Hi. Okay, Juno. Papa. Who was that boy that came to drop this firewood? Oh, Papa, that's Ike Mefuna, Auntie Neka's son. Why? I don't. Why? I don't, I don't understand, Papa. Why must he be the one to bring back the firewood for you? Papa, please, I've been through a lot of stress today. I don't have the energy for arguments. Please. Let me just take this thing. Ah. Oh, the man. But listen, Berente. Oku na ga wam wam. Anya na ga wam wam na fi. Papa, Biko, let me drop this. This is very heavy. Why would Papa think so negatively of a little kind gesture from a harmless fellow? What kind of gesture are you talking about? Huh? And who is harmless here? Listen, Ibuka. His fatherhood may not be known. Hey. But he is not harmful. He is harmless for all I care. And what he did was just offered help to me. That's all. Offer help? Obiajulu? Can you hear yourself speak? No, so you're now defending that idiot. Huh? Has it gone to that extent? I don't know what you and Papa is insinuating. I don't. He only saw me in a helpless situation and rendered help to me. I, I don't understand all this. So why did you spend so much time in the bush with him? Just to fetch ordinary firewood? Eh? Eh? Papa said the both of you spent a lot of time inside that bush. Doing what I don't know. And that was why he got so worried, thinking something has happened to you. Only for you to come back with that same idiot to this house. There was nobody to help me with the big boulder. I was there, I waited a long time and I didn't see anybody. I had to continue waiting. Listen, Obia, you know, all these are just silly excuses. Listen, and let this be a last warning to you. Let me sound this as a last warning to you. I mean, if you don't want to do anything with anybody in this village, let it be a responsible man, not that bastard. Before he defies you with his corrupted blood, I won't warn you on this again. Stupid girl. BBC Power! BBC Power! BBC Power! This coming election is our election. Yes, yes. yes sir. Yes. yes. This is time for this clan to be fully represented in the state house of assembly. Yes! yes. yes. That's so. Bam. Yes. The reason I called you boys here is not necessary to vote for me. Because I, I really know that everybody from this clan will yes, vote no. for me. Oh, yes. Yes. Sure. Right. Sure. Yes. Yes. yes, you are right. I'm sure of the vote. Yes, yes. The reason I called for you boys here, especially, is to keep you informed, to orient you on what is on ground. These days, the violent takes it by force. Yes. yes. These days, violence is the order of the day. Yes. At that day of the election, if they want us to drag the ballot buses, we will drag, we drag it. Yes. 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 If they want us to fight, we will fight. Yes. yes. 
if they want us to die, we'll die that day. Yes, yes, but yes, you, you see this election, we must win it. Yes, yes, yes. DPC power! DPC power! DPC power! I'm not a kid in this system. So I brought money, 200,000. <laughs> You see this money our brother, Honorable Jude, brought for us. It is pure commitment. It is pure commitment. Yes. Once you take your own share of the money, you are committed to be part of the election. If we don't go vote, we don't go there. You must be there. You must be there. Because it's going to be bloody. You are right. If you don't have a paper, come up for this. We don't go there. I repeat. You must be there. You must be there. Come up for this. Because it's going to be bloody. We are going to tell them. Yes. We are going to let them know that we have men. Yes. We have men. Yes. We have men. Yes. In this community. Yes. Hi. Hi. Um. Yes. You don't remember me. Obia Julu, the girl you helped carry her firewood home the other day. Of course I do. I remember you. I helped you carry your firewood because I felt you needed help. I was not expecting anything in return. I know. I... I saw you leaving the meeting when they were about to share money. And I was wondering if you didn't hear what they said. They want to share money. Sorry, don't bother about me. I, I knew they were going to share the money. I knew they wanted to share it before I left. You don't need the money? They won't give me. So it's better for me to leave there early than stay back and get embarrassed. Have a nice day. He did the right thing. I mean, you shouldn't expect us to give him a share from that man. What is wickedness? He should go to his father's land and collect his own share. I mean, he shouldn't expect to collect a share from a village he, he's, he's not from. But you people know that his mother is from this land. And so, does that make him a son of the soil? Eh? As far as I'm concerned, this is still humanity for me. Thank Gross you. wickedness. Thank you. always on his own. He's a quiet type and he doesn't even talk. My dear, he was subjected to such way of life. I mean, the treatment the people of this clan met out on him is totally inhumane. He has no other choice than to go on like that. <laughs> Whatever. What I mean is that he's always quiet. Whether it's his nature or he was forced into being so, I don't know. I don't know. He's so quiet. Well, all I'm saying is that people should treat him right. I feel sorry for him this time. Go away, go
Can I just see the table? Oh, Ada, you came to fetch water? Yes. Nice. Um, I'm sorry to bother you, but I just wanted to ask. Why are you always on your own? I mean, you don't talk to other people. Maybe that was the way I was created. No. God never created any man to be an island of his own. He created everybody to socialize and mingle with one another. Yeah, I know. But I... But what? It's a long story and I'm sure you know about that. No, I don't know anything. I would love to hear the story. I don't want to bother with my story. I'm fine. Don't no, worry. No, no, listen. You're not bothering me. Not at all. You are a very nice man. Kind-hearted. I mean, you don't deserve to be like this. Please, just leave me to bear my cross. Listen. I will not leave you to bear your cross. Listen to me. The other day you did not allow me to bear mine. So why will I leave you to bear yours? What is your friend? I thought both of you went to the stream together. Ha, Papa, I don't know what is wrong with Obia Drumo. She is there with that stupid boy and even refused to come with me. Which stupid boy? Uh, that bastard. What is his name? He came in now, Papa. He came in now. Huh? has been so terrible. So many times that I have wanted to take my life. But at the end of it all, I, I decided to take life as I see it. You're crying. I've never known joy. I've never known happiness. I'm isolated. Nobody wants to come around me except my mother. I am treated like a leper, like I have a very contagious disease that would contaminate anybody I come across. I was born just the same way every other person was born. You are aware that we don't marry from another tribe. Ah. Especially from Yibo. Yibo. Ajokutawa Mubi. We don't marry from them. Ah. I'm a Yoruba man too. One believe you, Banini. You. You can never marry her. Never. Baba. Baba. Ajo. Ajo. Baba. She has always given birth for me. Please, I'm begging you. She already have a son for me. But you are a disgrace to this family. Mama, you are a disgrace to this family. Mama, you are a disgrace to this family. You are a You are a disgrace to this family. We sent you to school to go and read and write. We sent you to school to go and learn. You went there and started living with a woman we did not marry for you. 
Did we send you to school to learn marriage or to acquire degree? Ask him more. Tell me. Ask him more. Tell me. Tell me is a disgrace. Baba, I'm having you. Huh? We already have a problem here. Uh, please, let us find solution to the problem. Instead of chasing this woman away, I, I, we already have, I, I have. She has a son for me. Please. You can never marry my son. Neka, you will not marry my son. It's against my tradition as a Yoruba man. You. Please, my elders, for the sake of this child, please, please accept me. Accept me. Accept you. Accept you. Accept you. You want us to accept you? My boy, Jim Basson, let me talk to her. You are a shameless girl. You are not cultured. In fact, you have no shame. You are useless, Olo Shi. Olo Buku Nyo or Lekole. You went and lived with a man who is not your husband. You got pregnant for him. And now you are telling us you cannot take this child to your people. Who do you want to take the child to? We don't need it. Go to our pastor. I said, I'm going to go to our pastor. I'm going to You have the shameless impudence to need a hand. And you're telling us you are sorry. You are this other. Go. I'm going to go. Ah, OK. Let us speak. Let us speak. Accept me for the sake of my child. Take, take this thing away from my house. You can throw it inside the river or throw it inside the bush. I cast not get out of my house. We cannot marry you both in this family. You are Omo Ali. Tell me, you are a disgrace to my family. Olu Lojo will never accept it that we marry from you both. Get out of my house. Oh, yeah, my, my Take boss. it away. Take, Take it away. away. Take it away from I here. My father rejected me. Shut up your shut up your mouth, Femi. Shut up your mouth, Femi. You lie. I don't want to see this thing and and this this woman in my house you should get out of my house never i can't not to you can take it to the goose throw it to the river Take it anywhere, but let us get out of my house. Okay, damn it, damn it. Uh, let me take them to the hotel. Uh, let us pass the night there. Tomorrow I can come back. Yeah, you have any? Come back here. She can go to this thing anywhere she likes. But you, you don't step any further from here. I am your father. Ah, but this is wickedness. It is not wicked. This is wickedness. I want to take that to your hotel. This is more. And you are not saying that. I said I get back to you. I am your father. If you step on me, your life I will cost you. Don't step on me. Ah, Bami. When you stop the uh, at, at that uh, that place at uh, the Okada stop first, just take the right down there. There's choice of there. Oh, look what Femi! Femi! So you can't leave us because of your father! Femi! What happened to all oh, the love that you promised me? Femi, what happened to all the affection that you were showing to me that made me give you my heart? Femi, my soul, and my body. And now, you are leaving me to be from somewhere. Ah! Look at, look at, why are you talking like this now? Why are you talking like this?
like this. I, I told you to, to go to the hotel. I, 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 do you want my DJ? Hey. 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 Do you want the money? Bro, hey, 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 hey. Bro, get out of here. Tell me, get inside. I cast not whether baby cries or baby does not cry. She can throw it inside the river or inside the bush. I cast not. It is I need to. I will come tomorrow to see you. Get inside. Oh, show me a little. I'm a Yibo. We marry from Yibo. So the children. My mother's kinsmen also rejected me. If you know where you got that bastard from, you better go in there and take it back to them. When I sent you to go and live in your uncle's house in the Jabodi, did I send you to any school? Why did you leave your uncle's house and follow him back to his house in school and live with him? Why? He said that our people have no value for education. And I was too intelligent to be pristined. He's very husband to help me acquire teacher education for me. So you now decided to go and live with a total stranger who has not come to see your people, even for worse. Please forgive me. Please forgive me. I know. I know. I have made a mistake. Please. Sorry. Sorry. You won't say this. Mega. Some mistakes are unforgivable. You have brought so much shame upon this family, and I will never be part of it. You better go in there and take that crying bastard to where it belongs to. Else, I will strangle both of you alive. I grew up having the stigma written all over me. The unwanted child. So I decided to be on my own. All my life, I have had the notion that I live among men who do not want me amongst them. Like I'm a butterfly amongst birds. What I don't know is when this is going to stop. Your story is such a pathetic one. I know. And I know I am still human. You're still human. A human with a heart of gold. You deserve to be punished because of the sins of your parents. You deserve a better life. Thank you. Thank you so much for giving me attention. I feel different now. I, I feel special. I'm begging you, please don't leave me. Don't join them. Be my reason to leave. 
and I'll be very grateful. On that fateful day, I discovered how wrong an assumption I have made of you. Where's if I would now? It's inside the bush. Yeah, I should follow into the bush just to help you and carry off your wood. I make it all. 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 It's just not healthy. It's so heavy. It's so heavy. You can't expect anybody to go into that bush to help you carry the fire. No, yeah? what do you want me to do? You want me to leave the fire? Why are you being selfish and it? You see. Is it that you bring that firewood out to this place? Or you divide it into smaller pieces to the one you can carry? This is nothing but selfishness. Who is being selfish? You are going to be selfish to tell. If you know what's good for you, speak to my husband, thank you. Or you wait for the person that will come with you. People are just being wicked and selfish, which is not fair. It's not fair, just firewood. Oh, thank God, someone is coming. Even this one that doesn't talk to anybody, walks and talks on his own like an imbecile. You don't have to. Do you want to come to this forest more than once so you could take all this firewood back to the house? That's some work, you know. Okay, I'll help you carry it. No, it's okay. I'll carry it myself. I'll help you carry it. I volunteer to do that. I said thank you. I will carry it myself. This. You're going to hurt yourself. Let me help you carry this. You don't have to come here more than once. That's the point. It's okay. It's fine. I'll just divide it into pieces. Can you just stop being obstinate and let me help you? Well, if you don't want me to help, I'll go. I, I was just trying to be of help. Let me help you. Please help me with the gun. Alright, you can get my trap and the bag and the machine. 
Alright, which way? Alright, let's go. Now I know better. I promise not to join them in their discrimination against you. I promise to be your reason to live and not to die. Thank you. Thank you so much. I have to go. My father. My brother. Yeah, I understand. Please. I want us to stay together like this again. I promise. We'll be like this from today. Thank you. Hi! Mm. So you have decided to ruin your life. No, no, you have made up your mind to drag the image of this family to the mud. Listen to this. Who the more chat to pull away? John will be with Namagama. A white chick that decides to display itself before the hawk, toys with death unknowingly. I am so disappointed in you. Hey! What have I done this time again? Papa, can I do one? You don't know what you have done this time again. The last time he followed you home, you claimed that the young man was doing everything out of his own good heartedness. Ooh. Now, what about today? What about today you are staring at me? Who's a market that went to the stream at the same time with you? Returned over an hour ago. What the go And what were you still doing at the stream? No, tell me, what were you doing at the stream? Obi Ajulu. I was I was with You were with who? Oh ho! You are even ashamed of mentioning his name. You see your life? Obi Ajulu, can you see your life? Obi Ajulu, let me even ask you. Of all the boys in this village, why that him? I don't know. His presence alone should irritate you. Of course. Obi Ajulu, are you this cheap? Hey! Papa, he is human. Hey! Shut up! I'm talking, you're talking. Hmm. What do you know? Okay, you look at me, Fuma. What do you know? Someone that his fatherhood could not even be traced from far away, Jebode. Jebun called it. It's a boyfriend, man. Ha! Oh, oh. Okay, you look hey! Okay, you look hey! Papa, let me just drop my gallon inside. Obi Ajulu. Obi Ajulu. Obi Ajulu. Na bonaka. Hey! Since someone came back from the street this morning, 
He has been extremely happy. Mama, you know where? Today is the happiest day of my life so far. Really? Imawata. So, wait. What makes it a special day? I met someone who gave me attention. Someone who actually sat and discussed with me for over an hour. Mama, I felt, I felt elated. I felt elevated. I felt like a human being. If I'd known that the love your father promised me was all a lie, I wouldn't have given in to him. I, I hate seeing my son being treated as an outcast. This is not the dream I had for my children. I dreamt that I would bring up my children in a special way, with love and a better life than I had. It's okay now. You have given me the best you can. You have been caring. You know, if not for you, I would have taken my life a long time. Oh, please, please, I beg you times without number. Don't think of such evil thoughts. I'm not thinking of those thoughts any longer because I have a reason to smile now. You are there for me. And I have someone special who cares for me. Let us see how soft my apple is. In our son. Ah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Una. Mama. Are you going? Eh. Uh, Dear Kennedy, there's something I want to discuss with you. Eh. Uh, yes, the grandma. Or the mama, not just a word of advice from Mama G. I just want to tell you to forget about what happened yesterday. You need to tread with caution. These people don't like us. Mama, she's different. Nah, she is not different. You will think she's different now, but she's not. They will eventually turn her to the other side. It will for that she's not different. Hello. Hey. Are you not happy to see me? I would be happy if I knew you would not leave me someday and back off on me. Back off from you, I don't understand. Listen, I know you might want to fight my cause, but the truth is you can't win this. Your people don't like me. They don't like my mother either. So I'd advise you stop this and save yourself the stress. We are outcasts, and I know it's only a matter of time before you began to treat me like every other person does. And why did you suddenly start thinking that I would not stay committed to you? Because this is not a fight you can win. It's one man against a whole community. Listen. I couldn't sleep all through the night. I kept thinking about you and everything you've been through. You really thought about me? Yes. And here you are doubting my commitments with you. It came. I am your friend. I want to be the reason you are happy. Your reason to live and not to die. Are you sure you thought about me like you said? Well, I was waiting to see if I would see you pass by. But I didn't. I need to go ahead and pick up my bundle of firewood. Oh, okay, not to worry. I'll come help you carry it to your house like I did the last time. No, no, it's okay. It's fine. You I'll see? Carry... You're just acting up. You're not proud of me. You don't want your people to see you and I together, right? No, no. Not that. Um, it's, it's... It's just... what? It's... Okay, fine. You can come help me with the bundle of firewood. Okay, show me the way. Let me yes. get my trap. I'm sorry. 
totally wrong with this too. What else? If not madness. <laughs> madness personifies. Please, let's go. Please. Stronger than anything. The love I have for you. It's just so strong. If they like it, and fight. Thank us. you so much. Thank you very much. <clears throat> Thank you. My pleasure Thank you to help. Let me run along to see my other traps and check up and see if they're oh, in the cut. Okay. All right. Okay. We'll get a good trap today, okay? Amen. <laughs> Thank you, eh? All right. All Thank right. you very much. I'm All very right. grateful. Thank you. Bye. What? Uh, 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 uh. Ebuka, please. If it's about to kill me, Funa, I don't have the strength for that now. Huh? Eh? Oh, no! My sister has been bewitched! Oh, I'm bewitched. Because he... Oh, you've been... You've been bewitched! Bro! No, it's a bad idea! You've bewitched my sister, have you? Okay. No problem. Papa, pa, no, Papa will hear this now. I have one money. Mama, let me give you the first gist. Uh -huh. She's committed to the friendship. She is? Very, very committed. <laughs> you need to see the way we were walking along the street, both of us, holding hands, and she didn't even mind or care what people would say. Is your... I'm telling you, Mama. Hey! <laughs> I, it looks like you made a great catch. I today. made a huge catch today. Aye. You know the good thing? What? When I was going hunting, she told me I was going to make a good catch. Chai. And it happened exactly the way she said. Oh, no, Fukuzo! I do my God. Yeah! I am so happy that you are happy. I'm happy, Mama. Aye. Very happy. Na. No. <laughs> Thank you, Matt. Chai. We're going to cook this one. Yes, ma. Can you give me any more? Oh, oh, Chai. Chai. He is so happy. Finally, he has a friend. have you come to do in my compound? I came to see you here, Juno. Hey! Can I get one here, You are bold enough to tell me that you have come to my compound to see my own daughter. Hey! How is she, man? Can I get my job? Wait. You have come to see you as your girlfriend or... 
As as what? Nah, she's my. She, you are giving me. Uh, you are what? Uh, came to see me. Yes. Mm. Mm. No. Mm. Sorry. He came around. Yes. As you predicted, I made a good part yesterday. Are you serious? I'm telling you. So I said, come give me your part of the good thing. While I run up to the market to go and sell the <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks for You're welcome. I, I shall be on my way now. I'll see you some other time. Okay, okay. Sell well, eh? Go! Okay, you know, go and drop that rubber at the backyard and return here immediately. We need to talk. No, just see so. Huh? He brought us the Ta Sean brought you meat. You know, they are not bush meat. Go, go, go to the back and drop that rubber. Brought you meat. Obia Jolo. Papa. I want you to tell me the truth. What is the meaning of this game you are playing? What do you think you are doing with that boy? Is he your stepbrother? Or is he your cousin? Or is he your boyfriend? I want to know. Now tell me, I want to know who the boy is to you. Why he's just a friend. He's just a friend. Oh. Yes. The boy has become Uzuamaka. Or he has become Mifunanya. That he's just a friend. You are talking about a fully grown man that is capable of changing your steps within a particular period. Yes! Capable of putting you in a family way. Papa. We can see. Don't you think you really don't know what you are doing? Uh, Papa, there is nothing going on between Ikim Ifun and I. It's just that I don't like the way everybody in this village treats him like an outcast. Uh, I'm just I'm just doing everything possible to, to at least make him happy and feel important like every other man in this village. Oh, this is wonderful. You are the one, the only one contracted in the whole of this village to make him feel happy like every other human being. Is it not so? I see. Oh, the man. And that is the only thing I will tell you. I want to go back to. Who is holding you? Leave here! My pan. Oh, you are crying. You have not even started crying. When I warned you about this boy earlier, what did you do? Papa, we didn't do anything. Ta! Shut up. The children about you petty liar. Shameless girl. Will you get up? and go into sleep. <laughs> you have not even started crying. Make. 
he didn't come back. Phone is not even going through. Hey, if you want to move, you can mark. But one also. Hey, I got one more thing. here for you. We are here for your useless son. Yes. yes. I don't have a useless son. Hmm? Okay. We are here to see your useless son, Ike Mefuna. Yes, yes. Why are you looking for him? Go inside and bring out your son. And we shall tell him his crimes right in front of him. Yes. Ike Mefuna has not been back since yesterday. Huh? I, I, I've been calling his phone and it's not connecting. But tell him that we shall come back for him. Yes. yes! Whether he likes, let him hide inside your pot of soup or anywhere. We, the youths of this village, have decided that we must give him his thorough beating. Yes. yes! Whether he likes it or not. Yes! Oh, what did he do? How about that, Joya? If he comes back, ask him. Youths, let's go. Let's go. Ah! Madam! You better tell you, just stop. Okay? Nenu <laughs> You're the only one that can tell me the truth. Can you tell one man? What did my son do? I mean, he's not been back since last night. I don't know his whereabouts. What, what, what has he done? I need to know. Your son, Ikemefuna, had the ghost to go and sleep with Obi Ajulu. I swear. I swear. My son can never do such a thing. I don't like him, my God. He will not. Are you trying to tell me you're not aware of the practical steps of your son and Obi Ajulu, um, Osondo's wife? Practical steps? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no. There's nothing like practical steps. Because my son can never do that. In case you don't know, they were in love a long time ago. Eh? And that was before they gave Obi Ajulu off to Osondo as a wife. Of course! After they killed my grandchild. See, my son, since then, Welweta, has never had anything to do with Obi Acholo. Then, why did he run? Eh? 
came on to where also why did he run away he was caught for dead and ever since then we have not seen him Egypt betrayed now Egypt eh Egypt should be Egypt one eh Neji came for that eh ha so what Anakwam I don't believe you it is not possible Anakwam He gave me food. He gave me Why? Why did you defy another man's bed with his wife? Why did you say no to the devil? 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 If only I know where you are, it's a mefuna. If only I fall some day, so you can be where you are on your son. Hey! Hello, man. What do I do? <sighs> My Elmo. It has been exactly two weeks and two days now that made you return our daughter home in anger. And nobody will blame you for your action. You did the right thing. But our people used to say, when you beat a child with the left hand, you throw the person close with your right hand. Please, oh, let point. your anger subside. Please calm down. We are begging you to come and take your wife home. We have advised her. We have cautioned her. She will never try that again. Oh, 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 oh. oh yeah. What I am saying is, personally, I am begging you, please. She is just a youth. And as such, her mind needs to be sharpened. Exactly. Of course, that has been done. I want you to please let whatever be in the night to be taken as night fly. For what I want her, no? Please. We'll, we'll try and give her this one more chance. If I let this be the last chance. And I'm assuring you she will check it. She'll be loyal to you. Please. Please. Okay. okay. I've heard you people. Uh, but we have to go home. Hmm? Let me think about the matter. I will get back to you later. Mm. <laughs> I go on to Kuban here. We are hoping to see you. We are waiting for you. Thank you very much. Aina, let's go. 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 Why would he come abandon me and just disappear? Sister, sister, it's okay. Mom, stop crying, it's okay. I know he will come. For two weeks. Two good weeks now, I have not heard from him. I have not seen him. He, he hasn't even bothered to get in touch. I, 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 I don't even know if he's alive wherever he is. I don't even know if he's dead. He's alive. He's not dead. Okay? Because, because I know that wherever he is now, he is safe. And why, why hasn't he bothered to call me? He will call you. I believe he will call. Yeah? Because, no, no. because of Ikem. My, my family ostracized me. They abandoned me. They don't even ask after me. You're the only one. You're the only one that comes from your husband's house to visit me. I don't know. What does he want me to do? He just abandoned me. Does he want me to kill myself? Is that what he wants? God forbid. You will not kill yourself. Eh? I know that people see him as a mistake. 
But I still believe that children are gifts from God. Then where is he? Sister. Where is my own gift? Where is he? He became your child should be your source of happiness. And not sorrow, and not cause, and not cry. He has abandoned me. What does he want me to do? Come. And what if he came is dead? What, what, what will I do? He will come back. He came to me, he will come back. He will come back. He will come back. Hello? My dear, I'm fine. It's just that I've been thinking about what you told me. My dear, this is not going to be possible. I believe you. And I still love you. It's just that this is, this is very... The... Yes. Yes. It came. I hope you're not misleading me. I know. Obi Ajulu. Obi Ajulu. All these calls. All these secret calls. You sneak out to come and make. Ha. Yaru kwanu yen nature. I hope it's not what I am thinking. And what are you thinking? I have just told you my own no. I hope it's not what I am thinking. Because Papa is doing everything possible to see that you go back to your husband's house. Whatever you like. Go ahead and think. Ah. It is none of your business. I have told you, keep sneaking. Ikem, I don't think it is right for you to keep your mother in the dark. Call her and let her know your whereabouts. She's the reason I'm in this mess in the first place. What wrong has she done to you? Why would she bring me out into this world without a father? Why would she bring me out to be ridiculed, intimidated, treated like an outcast? Why bring me out to a life of torment, a life of pain? It's okay, my dear. It's okay, Kim. Listen, I don't want you to cry any longer. All I want you to know, your mother never intended to bring you into this world, to be rejected by all. Let me tell you, no woman will mean bad for her own child. Your father and his kissmen rejected you. Your mother's kissmen rejected you. It is not her own making. It is not her making. I also want you to, to let you know that she is also a victim. Call her and let her know where you are. You're not calling her. We add more sorrow to her. Please. Please. <sighs> okay. I'll call her. But not now. It's okay. It's okay by me. If you want me, please don't leave me now. Uh, if you leave me, I, I, I'll be lonely. I, I, I'll spend the night alone and I'll be lonely. Sister. I did not tell my husband I'm going to sleep here today. I didn't. Hey, then at least call him. Use my phone and call him. Chineke. Morgan. You can make nice call him. <laughs> I told you. Hello? Am I good afternoon? How are you? Eh? And, and where are you? I've been looking for you everywhere. I'm fine. That's not important. He came here for now. Eh? Somewhere safe, Bukwana Guinea. I've been calling your number since and it wasn't going through. What matter is that I'm fine? Chimo, so you don't even want to talk to your own mother? That's how I want it, Mama. What matters is I'm good and strong and I'll call you and whoever whenever I want to talk to that person. Eh? Give 
me for no on on my family. Did I do anything wrong to you? Ama, that's how I want it. Ike me for now. Where are you, Bikunwam? Where are you? Uh, tell me now, so so I can come and see you. Ama, that's not important now. Uh. Like I said before, whenever I need to talk to you or when I want to see you, I'll make that happen. For now, I want to be left alone. Okay, okay, thank you, cousin. But, but your auntie is here, your auntie is here for my hold on, uh, hold on and talk to her. I don't want to talk to anybody more. Bye bye. Hey, Chimo. Thank God that he's alive. Eh? At least you've heard his voice. Yes, you will yeah. sleep well tonight. All right. But I warned him. I warned him about that girl. He wouldn't listen. Eh? Imagine going to someone's matrimonial home to go, to go and sleep with her. It's okay. Everything will be fine. Are you sure? Eh. I don't know how to tell you this, Obim. But the truth is, a part of me lives in you. I can't live without you. I, I don't know how it happened, but I just realized I can't go a day without seeing you. I'm sorry if I'm being too forward. But what I feel for you is way deeper than I can express. I feel the same way for you too. You do? Yes. I... I only wanted to be the reason you were happy. I only wanted to be the human that does not isolate you. Little did I know that there are so many beautiful things about you. The more I come closer to you, the more I see those unique creatures, full of love, full of compassion, full of care, I cannot go a day without you either. God, what do we do now? What are we going to do about this? Because I'm very certain your people will not let this happen. You and I know that. And the thought of me losing you forever scares me to death. I've been thinking about it for a long time too. And I've made a decision. I have decided to follow the direction of my heartbeat. I mean, you are the best thing that has happened to me. I have decided to fight to retain you against all odds. Oh my God. She feels exactly the same way as I do, so I, I, I think we should give it a try. Mm. No. It will not work. It's not working. What do you mean, Mama? What do you mean, what do I mean? See, oh, it's better you stop this love oh, now that it is still young. Eh, because of heartbreak in future. Now, what do you mean, what are you talking about, Mama? What do you mean, what am I talking about? You know exactly what I'm talking about. Don't you? I don't. You don't. I don't know what you're talking about. Wait, what, what? are you saying? That I, I should remain like this? I should not have a wife again? That is not what I am Simply saying. Simply because people do not want to associate with me, I, I should live and die this way. It's not what I'm saying. What are you saying then? Yeah, see, let me tell you, this thing is almost impossible. You know it's impossible for a grass cutter to pass through the eye of a needle. Just the same way it's impossible for you to marry that girl. I did look, these people don't, don't like us. And why go through that stress when there's an easy way to go around it? Oh yeah, what's the easy way, mama? The easy way? Hey, hey, come go see what my plans are. See, I've planned that I will go to a faraway village, maybe somewhere like Abakaleke, and get you a wife. See, Abakaleke girls are beautiful, tall, hardworking. Get you a wife. Happy marriage, happy everything. Give her an accord. Move. 
Nanya Bakiliki. Eh? If you are the Nanya at all. Meaning? You don't like me one bit. What are you saying? So, what are you talking about? You let her come in and live with us. Before you come. You know you are the reason for all this. You know you put me into this situation. Okay, okay. What do you mean I'm the reason for what? You are, you're asking me what I mean, eh? Yes. Okay. Hey! Chimebuemo. Femi! Femi, where are you? You see? The past has come calling. Better come on! Because the son you left in my care is asking questions. Hey! Abakaliki or not Abakaliki girls are beautiful, hardworking, elegant. They make wonderful wives. So, you can come now, Kodifa. I just say, "Bana, go home, Abacha." Ora, ora, the mama. Hey, now it's just a couple of Abakaliki. No, can you see village Ibani? Monday is our counting cause. Ha. Where are you going to? Um, I, 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 want, I want to to fetch firewood. To to fetch firewood. Oh, you don't go for firewood every day. No, you go to fetch firewood on daily basis, is it not? What about all the firewood we have at the backyard? Have we exhausted them? Papa, we don't have to exhaust the firewood at the backyard before I fetch more. Ah, you think I don't know your practical steps? You, you want to go out for whatever and return in ages? No, Papa. I will return as soon as I gather enough firewood. Shut up! If I don't see you here in the next 30 minutes, what I will do to you when you finally return to this house? You'll be shocked. Papa, don't worry. I won't waste time. I'll be back before you know it. Hmm? I should be happy I'm going to fetch firewood. leaving before my father starts getting worried. Ne. Because they are all Good day. Ne. Yes. Uh, please don't be offended. Eh? Yes. Did you see Kimifun on your way here? And where is Ikemefuna? You don't know who Ikemefuna is? Yes. Auntie Neka's son. Oh, the bastard. He is not a... I'm sorry, but I didn't see him. I only know him as a bastard from Ijabode. Yeah. <laughs> 
Good afternoon, Mama. Good afternoon. Who are you and, and what are you looking for? I... Why were you hiding behind the tree like a squirrel? Ibosa! Ibosa! I, I, I just, I, I came to see Ikeme Funa. I, I hope he's around. I, I'm sorry for hiding. Came to see Ikeme Funa. Why didn't you just walk straight into the house? Anyway, Ikeme Funa is not around. Sorry, but... Oh. Say something now, whoa, 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 whoa. say something. Where did he go? How would I know? Look at the Najum where, where an Ecolobia has gone to. How would I know? He's a young man. All I know is that he's not around. Um, I'm sorry. But, but please, when he comes, tell him, tell him I, I came around. I should tell him if you came around. Mr. Bwadu, I will tell him. One. Thank you, Mama. Mm -hmm. Give for my son. <laughs> Imagine those meat buyers. I wonder if they had a meeting for me or something. I'm coming. Hmm. 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 I'm, I'm coming. I'm late. Let me go and check my trap. Uh, she was here. Hey. Uh, I guess uh, she waited for you. You didn't turn up, so she decided to come and see you. She left not too long ago, but I'm sure by now she'll be home. <laughs> Mama, they better do my career. Yeah, I bet, I bet. My, my brother Menka, please, if I don't have her only today, please let her come inside the house, I live for my sake, please. Piko, Chadi, keep your words with you. She has to remain in this position until she learns to make use of her ears. The most annoying part of the whole thing is that I warned her when she was leaving. Yet she went ahead to do her own way, to follow her mind. Don't let me hit you there. No, no, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. They know what they do today. Everywhere, the same thing. Please forgive her. She's suffering. Please. Then what were you doing there? What were you doing since you left this house? What? What were you doing? What? Hey, it's all there. All the go now. All the go. All the go. Biko. What is she even doing with that boy? What is she doing with the boy? She is not going to marry the boy. Supposing she gets pregnant. Mba. Mba, mba, mba. Mba, mba, mba. Mba, mba, mba. Mba, Please, 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 are you in that zone? Why are you carrying this on your head? I'm telling you that. Hey! hey, hey. Papa! Nice. 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 You want to destroy my daughter? No, 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 no. no, 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 no. You want to destroy my daughter? No, 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 no. You want to ruin my own daughter? No! No! I only hope no respective in law. No, 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 no. I assume you want to ruin. No, no. Let me tell you. 
I am going to ring you here and now. No, please. I'm ringing you. Please, 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 Run in! Run in, I said. Run in! You want to come and destroy my daughter? Won't you go to your hometown? Won't you go to Ijebu? Not even Natalie Ijebu. Ijebu is there. Ijebu is there. Go there and look for a wife. Not my own daughter. I want to tie her with bushmeat. Nonsense. Mama, do you know I would have been a dead man by now? Oh, dear. Are you a chicken? Eh? Or a grass cutter and antelope in the bush? Okay, you buy your But the man was furious. Okay, do me, but he almost shot me dead. No, because stop being silly. Are you not a man? Did I give birth to half a man? Eh? Did I give back to a nuisance? On an abroad what are we even saying? If he were his own son, Ebuka, would he point a gun at him? Or any other young man in this village? Oh my god, none came. I know why they are doing this because you do not have a father. Yes, that's it now. Egebuzi and Yebu, over my fault. Oh, Femi, I blame Femi. It's, it's all his fault. Femi and his stupid people that I blame. It's okay, Mama. This is not it's okay because it's not okay. Every time they'll be treating you anyhow. It's not fair. It's not fair. What can more? Oh, to do your way. Oh, now, Paula. Okay, I'm going to see you. You're going to be able to come and just face you again. Mama, I'm going to see you. I'm going to see you. Obi Ajulu. The reason I will not prolong my wrath on you is because you are the one that has the keys to my belly. Initially, I was thinking your mother was the best cook in the whole world, but you have just proved me wrong. <laughs> Thank you, Papa. I I actually wanted to talk to you about something. Mm. Well, in this mood, there is nothing I cannot tell you. So, ask whatever I will answer you. I can even tell you the secret I never, I didn't tell your mother when she was alive. If I hadn't intervened. Would you have shot a came for me? You see, my daughter, there are certain things that are done out of anger, only to regret afterwards. Actually, I was bitter. I was angered by that boy. But I, I won't be here now to tell you that I would have shot him or I wouldn't have shot him. I can tell you that. You talk about my mother so much. Why is it so? Why did you marry her? <laughs> Don't go there, my daughter. Don't! That is a no-go area. 
Your mother and I were the best love book. Everybody, anybody in the whole village could read. We were so much in love. Naturally. As a matter of fact, I still feel her presence. Even at death. And I'm very, very sure that wherever she is now, she still feels the love. Yes, even in the land beyond. Papa, do you know your children could actually marry the ones they love? The same way you married my mother. not about that boy. Love with that boy is a wrong one. There are a lot of boys, big, big boys that are doing well in the city. They can come and love you, marry you, pick you, take you to the city, you become somebody. Take you out of this village. Not good for nothing boy. They both be good for nothing. Of a man. Please. I, I, will, I will beg one thing. Don't spoil this good mood. Let me enjoy this mood. Is he truly worth my love, my life, my everything? But I love him so much, and the more they try to stop me, the more my love for him grows. He came. Why did you have to come into this world in such an unholy manner? Why must it be you that will be regarded as a son without a father? In all these things, my love for you still remains. Life is a lesson, life is a teacher, nobody can tell the future of tomorrow. Life is a lesson, life is a teacher, nobody can tell the future of tomorrow. You can't predict 